Group two, how do you think your group performed in your challenge? The first challenge is definitely uh, a tester. It's hard to compare a diner challenge to a brunch challenge because the food is so different. Group one, what's your thoughts? Group two, definitely take the easier way out. I think with us, we did use a little bit more technique. We did, you know, risk it a little bit more. I think group one used a lot more technique in their menus, and so we probably didn't reach the level of techniques that group one used. Well, I think the thing that was most disappointing from my point of view wasn't necessarily the critiques about the food, it was some of the comments about us being arrogant. That probably hurt us a little. Who said that? I can't remember. I said it. it. Yeah, yeah. I said it. I don't mind. How are you feeling about group two? You guys were so arrogant about how you cook. So that was probably the thing that was most disheartening because that didn't seem like a critique about food. That was a, dis a critique about... Your group. You literally said our food was up to the level of what was served at the diner challenge. You served a salad with vinaigrette, which would have been exciting in 2009. You guys served a burger with chips without chips. All of that food was inedible, and you're saying that our food is like that. That's arrogance right there. The words that came out of your mouth you chose were really rude. That's your personal problem. No, it's actually not. No. No. What you said is rude, doesn't matter who you say it to.